punch a punch punch. Hello and welcome back to Crunchcast. Hello. I am Crunchins and this is Apex Wolf. Hello. How's it going? <laughs> <laughs> this is a podcast where we talk about stuff and uh, yes, today we're basically answering all of the weird and random questions that I got on my last AMA. So uh, yes, thank you to everyone who has asked questions in advance. So we're going to start off with a question I think has been on everyone's mind, um, and that question is: Do you like cheese? Oh. Do you like cheese? I like cheese. Yeah. Do you like cheese? I'm fond of cheese, but it depends what kind of cheese, really. I like red Leicester. <laughs> oh, red Leicester! Yes, sir. You you, you are talking my language. <laughs> That's a, that's a good question. I, I, I'm uh, I'm fond of Red Leicester. That's my top, Red Leicester. Yeah. I'm I'm a basic person. The basic, yeah. Um, I don't I'm like not... anything too mature. No, I, you know what? You are right on the money there. Yeah, I think we agree on our cheeses. Definitely. I, I am actually open to <laughs> some of the weirder cheeses. Like I quite like that cranberry cheese that Ooh, you kind of get at that. Christmas. Oh, I don't right. know what it is, but I can't remember like the type of cheese it is, but it's got cranberries in it. That's yeah. nice. Um, I also like, uh, um, well, on occasion, and it depends what it's with, brie can be quite nice, actually. Is that the smelly one? It's weird, and it looks like kind of white melted rubber. Oh. Um, but there's, there's, a, there's a panini that I, I sometimes buy that's brie and bacon, and in that combination, it's very nice. Ah. But I have had brie on a different thing, and I was like, bleh. So it depends. Depends on what it's what it's on. And that question came to us from Aura Master Yumi. <laughs> Make us sound like old men, but thank you for the question. <laughs> yes, thank you very much for talking about cheese with us. Um, <laughs> uh, next question, again, a uh, very very important question. Um, and well, well, this one is actually a nice a nice question, and it applies to us both also. How is your dog? How is, um, how's your dog, Apex? My dog's, my dog's all right. He's a bit old, but yeah, he's still going. Right. <laughs> yeah. Good. How, how's your dog? My, my dog's good. My, Marvel is my dog, and he's he's good. He's currently in the room next to me, lounging on the sofa. Yeah. Um, I just realised, how, how does he know we have dogs? How do you uh, know? Because I have a couple of videos with, with, dogs, oh, yeah, you do, uh, with yeah. my dog on it, so uh, ah. I think they probably watched that and then yeah. commented it. So, but they didn't know that you did. That was just purely coincidence. Pure, pure luck. Yeah, yeah. Um, now I've I've been asking these questions in a weird sort of order. That question came from Geometry Dash Ticho again, who we've had questions from in a previous podcast. So thank you again for the question. Uh, I've been asking these in a weird order to the one I've written them down in for some bizarre reason. Um, so forgive me if I uh, if I get confused for a minute. The next question is a little bit um, more, I guess, personal. Is coming comes from Dake Wolve or Captain Dark Wolf in brackets. Yeah, not so. And it's what is your sexuality? Now I, I'm I don't mind talking about it. Um, <clears throat> I personally uh, am heterosexual. <laughs> um, I've been with my girlfriend for five years. Um, but I'm a big supporter of like whatever sexuality people are or want to be, they should be yeah. able to be that. No judgment here. Exactly. Yeah. I, I mean, I've had people in the past who have kind of, particularly when I was a lot younger, tried to sort of brainwash me into thinking that uh, you know being prejudiced was was the thing to do. But I, I'm not not having any of that. I think everyone should be entitled to be happy and as long as they're not hurting or killing people then that's fine really (laughs) in my in my eyes (laughs) and and for me i'm a i'm a fairy you're (laughs) no i'm not really i'm i'm straight also but uh someone did ask me if i was a fairy i think that's a sexual thing isn't it? i think people do have fairy fetishes don't they yeah so uh but yeah, like to each of their own. I won't yeah. judge. But uh, yeah, I'm I'm straight as well, or heterosexual for the yeah. least. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I I'm not. I've never really um, looked into furries, um, 
but I, I, I can imagine it being kind of cosy, <laughs> I, I suppose. I was like took back by the question because like obviously it's a describing word and one I didn't know about it's like it's like the same as saying are you a hairy or yeah I was like what what's a fairy yeah I, yeah I didn't realize that it existed I'll be honest when you first said it I thought you said fairy yeah <laughs> yeah so that question is covered thank you for the question Dake Wolve if I'm pronouncing that right who knows who can tell um, next question um, is now again this is this is very important and we need to take this very seriously okay get my serious hat on do you like turtles I can't believe you just asked that I like turtles <laughs> wow <laughs> <laughs> no uh, I don't next question you don't like turtles <laughs> have you seen that boy on, yeah with the, on YouTube? With the, the skull yeah. face yeah <laughs> I love I love that boy <laughs> because it's just that he has no regard for anything that has been asked of him, like the the interviewer is just says something like, "Now we're here with with Jonathan, who who's dressed up as a fantastic zombie, um, and what do you think of all of the Halloween?" <laughs> and uh, he just kind of just goes, "I like turtles," <laughs> and she's so thrown that she just kind of goes like, "Oh, okay, Gr- great zombie," <laughs> and just like walks off. Because he throws her off topic so much. I, I think I've got a lot of respect for, for the I Like Turtles boy. He trolled her. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a big fan of comedy used in such an obscure situation. Them that, dank memes. Yeah. yeah <laughs> that nobody has really had time to digest it. So, um, I like turtles, uh, but Apex Wolf does not like turtles. Thank you for the question, Defab Turtle. So, I mean, I don't mean to, uh, to to put you on the spot, Apex, but you've probably offended the Fab Turtle uh, now. You know, what can I you probably do? should have uh, should have said the name <laughs> yeah, first. Said the name first. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, turtles are all welcome here. Yeah, let's let's go on to another question. Um, this one is from Frass Animation. So thank you for the question. And uh, this is a topic that I think confuses a lot of people and needs a lot of detailed explanation. Where do babies come from? And I'll hand over to Apex Wolf. Well, you see, um, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they just appeared one day. The, I, I was told about the stalk and the, the sack, and no, <laughs> is that not right? <laughs> yeah, the, the, the stalk comes along and he drops a baby through the chimney or something. Yeah, that's what happens. Um, all. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Um, <laughs> I've heard that. That when a mummy and a daddy love each other very, very much, they take a degree course in mechanical engineering, <laughs> and they they build a baby from scratch. Ah. And so we're all machines, and we're sort of we're all on a journey, man, and it's this whole whole Don't thing. Know. That's a conspiracy that yeah, we're, the, we're we're still the simulation. Yeah, you know? the, the government are pulling the wool <laughs> over our eyes. Don't let them. You're all a machine. We're all one big machine. Mm. Yeah. Yes. They come from somewhere. Yeah. But, I mean, I don't think we're qualified, really, to, to answer in no. too much detail. But thank you for the question, Frass yeah, sh- Animation. Sh- shout out to Frass Animation. Yeah, yeah. And now, I think we're on our last question, actually. Is it a... Which... Is it a serious one? Um, not really, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, I suppose it's a serious one. It's It's not really... It's just... I put this question on this topic... Because I, I didn't know where else to put it. Mm-hmm. Um, it's from Charai5, our good friend Charai5. Hey. Um, whose channel you should go and check out because he does the voices for some of my cartoons and and we've all collabed together and stuff and animates and stuff. Um, and his, his question really is doing me a big favour. <laughs> and I didn't ask him to say this. Where can I buy a Crunchlins t-shirt? Ooh. <laughs> Charai5, you, you've... You've just just helped promote me, yeah. lovely fella. <laughs> the plug. Well, Gins. if you head over to the Crunch and the Stash Riot store, uh, the, the the Earl is uh, www.stashriot.com forward slash collections forward slash Crunchlins hyphen shop. I'll put it on the in the description. Did you call it the Earl? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I called it the Earl. Is that, is that... I've never heard that one before. Oh. I'm going to start using that. <laughs> um, and, yeah, if you head over to my, my shop, you can buy multiple T-shirts and mugs also, and probably a load of other things down the line as well. 
like posters and stuff. Yeah, I will. For me, I'm definitely going to grab one of them mugs. Um, being Ooh. a collector of mugs, I'll have to grab one of them. I I love a good mug. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so remind me, where can I purchase a mug? You can purchase the mug at www.stashriot.com forward slash collections forward slash crunchlins hyphen shop. Cool. I'll have to pick me up one of them. Yes. I'll probably put the link on the old uh, the old <laughs> screen now as well. Um, just so that people don't get confused by the long web address. Thank you for all of the questions. And, uh, <laughs> Charo, thank you for allowing me to plug my own merch store at the end there. You, you lovely chap. <laughs> If you've got any other questions that you want us to answer or that you'd like me to answer with other guests and stuff, uh, then leave the comments below and tell us what you want to know. Yes. I'd like to thank Apex Wolf for joining me on these last three podcasts. Oh, thank you very much for having me. Not a problem, not a problem, brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> and and uh, thank you very much for watching, if you've watched this far, and have a good day. Bye. Bye! <laughs> hey, thanks for watching, or listening, or whatever it was that you did. Please make sure you go and check out this week's guest, Apex Wolf, on his YouTube channel. The link's in the description below and on the screen now. He's a fantastic animator and a really cool guy. Definitely check him out. And if you'd like to leave me a question or a topic to discuss in another podcast, leave a comment below with said question or topic, and I'll try and discuss it next time. Also, if you'd like to subscribe or watch something else, click on the screen now. Thank you very much and goodbye.